Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today I got another build for you. And um, we're checking out Blast once more. So, straight up, I didn't get too creative with this build. Uh, as you can see, it's pretty much all just Risen Kaiser. And then the Risen um, Kushala legs for that Wind Mantle. Which is a um, new meta, I would say. And um, yeah, we got uh, all the good stuff here to make the Blast better. We got Blast Attack for that Blast build up plus 20%. We have Powder Mental level 3 for even more explosions. We got Theostra Blessing, which boosts Blast by another 10%. We got Redirection in here because my plan is to just spam Sacro Slash the entire time. And uh, using Redirection to get the Y Bucks back, right? And um, then also, I want to mention the food skill that is Dango Specialist, which also increases your Blast by another 10%. So, yeah, I'm expecting a lot of explosions. Um, let's take a look at the decorations. So we are using the Teostra Longsword with um, two levels of Blast Augment and two levels of Attack Augment. I wish you could go for more Blast, but sadly level 2 is the maximum. So uh, yeah, gonna put one Expert in there and then whatever the monster is weak to in the Rampage slot. For the head we have Blast Critical, for the chest Critical Mighty, for the arms Blast Plus and Redirection Plus. For the coil we have Handicraft Plus, y -Bug, and for the legs Handicraft Plus and y -Bug Plus. The charm I'm using is a quick shift 2 with 2 level 2 slots and we got tenderizer and critical in there. So uh, yeah, let's check this build out. And here we go, he actually spotted me somehow. Dude, these guys are way better at uh, spotting you compared to high range monsters. I'm pretty sure they changed something about that. But uh, yeah, whatever. So my main plan for this fight is to just spam um, or this build. Is to just spam second slash the entire time. Get the wire back with uh, redirection. Because yeah, um, with Sacro Slash, it's so easy to make use of Harder Mental and uh, just the natural Blast buildup. Look at this, we already have Harder Mental ready. And I also see a lot of explosions from the normal Blast. Let me dodge there, that's hopefully. Oh, okay. <laughs> As you can tell, I'm not too comfortable against this guy. I honestly didn't enjoy the normal Shigaru Megala and Gormagala that much in this game. Even though Gormagala was my favorite fight in Generations Ultimate, I just don't feel them in this game. But yeah, uh, with this guy actually, I think they, they took the best of both of them and turned it into one fight. It's just lack of practice, I guess. Only fought them enough to make the armor. Hopefully get in a second slash right here. Ornamental is almost ready. Ooh, nice. It's kind of insane how fast you get the Valen right if you just spam second slash. That's some good damage. Nice explosion. Um, too late on redirection. I thought I could blame it on the the thing not being on the on the action bar, but I was just bad. Um, yeah, what the fuck kept from it? It's impossible to tell with which part of his body is going to hit you right there. That was like his dick, right? I'm pretty sure. But yeah, whatever. Let's go that. Let's go for another second round. Block that. Nice. Um, my cat hasn't dropped a wild back. Oh, she did. She did. I'm sorry, cat, for doubting you. There we go. Definitely need Y box back. And definitely need Red Gauge. Well, I guess we don't need Red Gauge, but you know what I mean. Yeah, he actually hits you with a stick. Confirm. Let's go for Serene. Not too bad. I'm happy with that. Um, yeah, I thought it would be completely safe there for some reason. Not too sure why. Hopefully there's enough time for the big hit. Should be fine. Yeah, at least we didn't miss. Alright, cool. Try to go for redirection there again. Bad timing. Is he chilling? Why? Yo, we actually hit something there. Nice. Let's go. It's acting kind of weird. Let's get in there. Nice. And guys, Power Mental, I think... Maybe I was wrong about level 1 being enough. Maybe you actually want to go for level 3. It's it's actually quite noticeable, the difference. 
And I mean, the Risen Theostra set is really good anyway, so yeah. Alright, that's it for Area 1. Let's chase him. But uh, let's actually grab this thing. Is that another bug? No, that's the one I picked up. Alright. Don't forget to sharpen like I usually do. Um, we also have the Blast Toad. Actually, took the time to pick that up. I'm, I want to hit him with every single blast we have in this game. And I think now is actually a good time, you know, knock him out of that um, that chaos thing. Um, yeah, <laughs> whatever. Just don't miss the Thunder Beetle. All right, all right, we're good. Yo, I actually already lost the third wild bug. Let's pick this up then. Uh, use redirection on that. And now we Sacro Slash. Hopefully at his face, get that KO. Lovely. And yeah, after this big hit, we're hopefully close to knock him out of that uh, KO state. Alright, yeah, that's close enough. Let's go. That is white gauge. That is yellow. Not that it's that important with this place. Uh, I'm just playing second slash to be honest. But yeah, I guess we should go for more serene poses. Nice. I guess we go right here. That was not a good, good idea. But hey, uh, now we know. Um, by the way, it's so weird. It's impossible to tell if it's gonna follow up with another wing attack there, right? I think. Oh yeah, that's a huge opening. I forgot. Dodge that. Nice. Uh, we can go for Serene Pose if he does something good. I thought that was an attack. Alright, that, that works. Awesome. Bad timing on redirection. Definitely have work to do on this guy. Automental is ready. Awesome. Get that explosion in. Probably was going to go for the other wing attack. For the faster one. That one. Can you stop missing me? Please. Ooh, nice. I actually, that was my only option to avoid damage right there. Can you just roll that? Yeah, nice. Thought that attack was harder to dodge, to be honest. Charge, alright. Spam that Sakura. Ooh, what a play. What a play. Let's go. Grab the bar. Can let me saw. Nice. Uh, we can go for Serene Pose. Shouldn't do it on that move though. Very nice. Let's go for another Serene Pose. What the fuck was that move? I've never seen that. You see an opening after that? It's kind of weird. Alright, let's go. I think we should be close to us. Gal on this guy. That's just a feeling. And yeah, he chills for a second after he gets up. And there we go. We could capture, but uh, let's finish this like a man. And die. No, I'm just kidding. We got this. Use redirection, just use sex slash in his face, just use swing pose. If it does something good. Oh, yeah, you don't want to use it on that one. Pulls up his head at the end. Let's just go for it. Ooh, nice, let's go. That was lucky. Don't leave, don't leave. Let's go, that is perfect. We can finish him off in this area. I'm just gonna go for this on yellow. I think that might be enough. Let's go, even though we got a bad hit. Alright, alright. Um, what do I think about this build? I I didn't see that many explosions at the end, but that is normal, right? They they get resistance to the to the blast towards the end. But um, yeah, I think that wasn't too bad. I think that's actually my fastest time I ever got on this guy. 
and uh, didn't even use any augments. So I think this playstyle and this build works really well. Uh, let me know what you think. And as always, happy hunting. Bye-bye.